is sad. This is really sad, man. These flowers were nice and pretty the other day. And then it snowed. It's Can you be a little scared there? Did you, get, did you pee a little? No. Oh, okay. Did you see it? Did I do good? Yeah, you did awesome. All right, all right. We're on our way to Brittany's. We gotta go to, uh, we gotta go get some more stuff done. Yeah. Veronica's gonna fill more orders and stuff, and I'm gonna cut the grass. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna cut Roman's grass. I cut my grass. Why can't I cut Roman's too? More smile more orders. Heading out right now. We gotta take them into the post office. You know it's a big deal when we bring all of our mail right here to our post office. Yeah, I'm glad. And to they see love you us guys. here. They I really do. love us. I do. You know I do. Hey, let uh, me get all the packages for you. Too. All the soldiers say thank you. Oh, you are welcome. Thank you. This is the woman responsible for making sure you guys get all your stuff. Oh, thank you so much. You guys are awesome. <laughs> you're, you're interested to see where I used to live? Yeah. We're, we're actually cruising, we just dropped off the orders and we're cruising down um, the area where we used to live, where I used to live when I was going to school in Millersport. And I guess I'll show you. Roman already showed you in his vlog. If he vlogs his back. house? No, he showed mine too. No, I didn't see that part. I swear to God he did. <laughs> I didn't see that part. There's a marina, Buckeye Lake Marina. This spot right here, Weldon's Ice Cream, oh my god. They have the best homemade ice cream. They make everything fresh right there, and it's delicious. Hey. Oh, hey. that sound means I should probably put my seatbelt on, huh? What's your seat what street was it? It's not 7th. Was it 9th? It's 9th. It was 9th. Yeah. Me and Brittany were talking about Roman it used day. to live on 8th, and his house is up that street. And then, where I used to live, it's right over here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. It's right there. Can you see it? Can you guess which no, one? No, I can't. It's this one right here. That one right there. No, that white one? Yep. That white house. That little piece of crap right there. For sure. Hmm. And that's my buddy Zach Water used to live. And the Holmes lived there. And I think her name was Kelsey Rathbone lived there on the corner. And, and that's the Sweet Corn Festival, Festival over there. Right there. At the end of the summer, we'll go up there. We'll take you guys up there. The Sweet Corn Festival is pretty cool. It's uh, Miller's Ports, like, claim to fame. <laughs> the Sweet Corn Festival brings in tons of people. And they have all kinds of, like, booths and games and rides. And Good corn. Corn, yeah. Corn on like, the, the big thing is... Favorite. They have this giant booth where all it's the, the only thing you get is sweet corn, and they have like corn eating contests and all this. And it's really good. Corn. It's really good corn. Yeah, they butter it for you. They, they they butter it. They put the butter. It's probably my favorite food. Corn. Corn on the cob. Oh. Yeah, because after after you're done eating it, you're like <laughs> <laughs> picking it out of your teeth for an hour. Okay. Savors the flavor. <laughs> oh, this street right here. My buddy Jonathan lived right there. Right oh, was there. that one? No, that was his grandma's house. Oh. Brittany, you're still at home, so uh, I think you're gonna have to change your shirt. I think so. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of mail. I mean, great minds think alike, but something's yeah. gotta give here, dude. It is beautiful today. I gotta tell you, spring, summer, it's my favorite time of year, as it is probably everyone else on the planet. It's just so nice out. It feels like people come alive. You can be outside, you can enjoy the weather. People's attitudes are 100% better, more positive. It's a good day to be outside. I'm actually looking forward to mowing grass. You probably can't hear me, but this guy's a beast. 
Let's get our mow on. So it turns out this little mowing adventure has been a lot more than I had bargained for. We have a little catch up to do guys. So I lost my camera. As I'm mowing, I, grab, I tried to grab my camera and I'm like, because I wanted to vlog what was happening. It's really wet back by the woods, right? And I wanted, I got the mower stuck, right? The mower was stuck in the mud. And I wanted to vlog it, right? So I go to reach for my camera, I'm like, crap, I can't find my camera. So I thought I left it in the Jeep. So I had Veronica pull the Jeep back to pull the mower out, the Jeep got stuck. I had to call Dale, Domino Dale, to pull the Jeep out in the Xterra. And I still couldn't find my camera. And I'm walking the grounds, I'm looking, I'm trying to find the camera. And wouldn't you believe that the camera fell out of my pocket and got stuck underneath here. And it was rubbing up against the pulleys that make the blades go. So that, let me go inside, I'm gonna show you in the mirror what the camera looks like now. Look at the camera. Look at it. It's all messed up. Good thing this thing is all metal. Otherwise it would have been trashed. Dude, this camera has been through everything. The back of it's broken. Now the front of it's all scratched up. So even though my camera got messed up, my phone actually even fell out of my pocket and I felt something tugging on my earphone and my earbuds. I was like, what the heck is that? And I looked down and my phone was dangling down there too. So my phone was about to meet the same fate as my camera. And I'm really glad it didn't. Thank God this thing's really tight. This, this has been one heck of a, and I still have some more to mow. I still have about an acre and a half to mow. <laughs> I finally finished mowing. It's 8 o'clock. I started at 3. So it took 5 hours for me to mow this yard. But I did get stuck twice. So I got a mower stuck, a jeep stuck, and that's about it. Got some Minecraft action? What are you doing? Whoa! Ah! Whoa! Jeez! Yeah! You're staying here? Yeah. Really? You want to stay? Listen. Well, I can't stay. stay Are you guys going to eat popcorn and watch yeah. movies and stuff? Yeah. Right on. We're sleeping over at your house. Okay. Do you want to stay here? Okay, that's fine. Okay. What? Do you want to stay? No, I'm going home. Why? Because I got to go home. I got to uh, wash my hair or something. Hey honey, did you see all the the people that have made this this uh, Alfredo roll? A bunch of people. I'm just looking at my Twitter. A bunch of people made the um, Alfredo roll. Looks good. They're loving it. They want more Veronica. Delicious. More Veronica vlogging. More Veronica cooking. Look right here. Love your vlogs, man, but we need more hashtag Veronica vlogs cooking <laughs> show. Veronica needs to get a Twitter, doesn't she? And an Instagram. And an Instagram. Colin's spending the night with Noah, and Carson's coming with us. You're coming with me, dude. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Colin, we're leaving, dude. Have Bye, fun. Yeah. I love you. Oh, oh, oh. I love you. Be good. Dad, look at this. What is that? <laughs> it's a conehead ghost. That's a Pokemon? Yeah. Oh, Pokemon. I already got, like, I have this whole entire binder full of them. All Pokemon cards? Mm -hmm. See, look at this one. I've seen that one on TV. Dude, that's awesome. And then I have all of these. Hey, Noah, Noah. Are you a Pokemon and fan? And then I have all of these. Holy cow. You got more cards and than I got money. <laughs> but tomorrow, I have to go work with my dad for the first time in a while. 
my sister and my brother Josh, they both work for my dad. They do the window cleaning thing. And Amanda is nine months pregnant. And Josh and Samantha, they just had a baby. So my dad's crew is kind of short right now. And so he needs my help. So I'm gonna rock out some windows tomorrow. $20 only gave me five gallons of gas. I'm gonna boycott, I'm gonna start boycotting gasoline. Someone please invent the water powered engine. That would save the planet, maybe. Here we are at the Everhart house hall. We got a room full of kids in here. What's going on? What's going on? Is there a party? Is this a party? Family sleepover. Family sleepover? What's the occasion? You didn't even, you didn't hey, even invite me. It's till Sunday. Everyone stay until Sunday. Look, we got a room full of people here. This, this is where I want to be. Let's break out the whiskey, boys. I'm the only one drinking. Are you? As usual. Scott loves the Outer Banks so much, he reads up on it at home. <laughs> You miss the Outer Banks? Yeah. Do you miss it? Mm -hmm. We were there. We were there a week ago. Two weeks ago. Is it two weeks? Two weeks. Holy cow! I can't even take it. Well, when we go back, we're going back in September. When we go back, it's gonna be nice. Warm. I'm gonna get even more sunburn than I did that one day. Could be lobsterfied. <laughs> These guys are going to bed. We showed up way too late. Jimmy's drunk on Kool-Aid. Scotty's, Scotty's high on life. Woo! I mean, I, I thought we were going to party and you guys are all Crashville. Oh well. I'm going to the bar. You can go to the bar with me if you want. You're going to the bar? One of these. Really? I drove separate. I could always drink and drive. Why not? Drink, drive, yeah. fast. Take chances. That's a bad example. I can't do that. These guys, they look up to me. I'm like a role model. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Lindsay. We'll miss you. It's good to see you. Bye, Scotty. Peace out. Jimmy. Peace out, man. Alright, really short and sweet. I, I definitely forgot to uh, close the vlog yesterday. Carson wasn't feeling very good, so I had to lay with him so he could fall asleep. And I fell asleep too, so it's obviously the next day and I gotta go to work. So I'm finishing up editing this vlog and we'll get it to you as soon as possible. That's it for today. I love you. I'll see you right back here tomorrow.